This is in St. John's. I had to come and look at some banging steam lines, and then when I looked up in the ceiling, I found that that white pipe there, the one that's whiter right there. Uh, yes. With the open ends that look like cardboard, that is his best to sell. That's his best to sell insulation. Kind of like, aside from loose insulation, that's a loose asbestos. That's the worst insulation you can have. It's like cardboard corrugation with pure loose asbestos inside. And it's open like that. And when the pipes bang again, or anybody who lifts tiles or moves them, it comes out of there. And those ends are supposed to, aren't sealed. And the joints aren't sealed. The cracks between are not sealed, so everything leaks. Asbestos. You know, up where it goes over top of the hanger, it's just it's just open. Unsealed air cell. So aside from downstairs, and that is best to sell, I showed that to the safety people here, and we're going to see what they're going to do about it. This is upstairs. This is one of the classrooms upstairs. This is typical of all the classrooms in St. John's. It has those heaters that go into the cabinet, and in I've worked on these, and in almost every one, in every room, you're going to find inside this cabinet Oops, ouch. You see that insulation that's open-ended that looks like the end of cardboard there? That is as best to sell insulation and it's just in terrible shape in these cabinets. Not only that, anytime there were as asbestos elbows on these pipes in the cabinets, they just knocked the crap off and it's all it's all down in there and it's 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 the, those chunks there. But the worst is that as best to sell that loose shit. And the worst thing about this whole situation is that this thing has fans. This thing turns on and actually blows from here. So I've showed them. We'll see what they do about it. And it's just time to start kind of documenting what I see here. It's just incredible the amount that's around and the shape that it's in. I mean, that's just incredible in this day and age that that's existing here where students use these classrooms. That's just right in this classroom. And they're all like that. So it's time to start documenting all this. You see also, not only, like I said, just to show you, not only is the the air cell on the some of the pipes, some of the other pipes has uh, fiberglass insulation, but the elbows are all asbestos. You know, and you look, and you just look at how how dirty that is, and how the asbestos is fiberglass by the valves. Yeah, it's fiberglass then uh, asbestos 90, and fiberglass by the valve, then asbestos 45 as it heads down into the floor. And it's just in shit shape. Excuse my language, but there really is no other way to describe this stuff. Like, that is just the most friable crap on a unit with a fan. I mean, holy crow. see anything in there? Not really, but I mean this thing has a big thing that turns around in it. A big squirrel cage. Yeah, there you can see it, sort of. And it blows, you know? This loose, dusty shit everywhere. At least the potential is really there for it to do it. I mean That thing's loaded with asbestos and that fan blows and everybody just sits in these rooms.